Hello guys, my name is Brendan Rich. Today we're doing 100% on the ultraviolence difficulty of the Ultimate Doom. This is Episode 4, Map 6, Against the Wickedly. Let's get to it. So this is one of my favorite maps because of not only the map design, but also the theme. I love this theme. It's only used in one other, uh, one other map. My gosh, my speech. It's late guys and I'm tired. But that's okay, because this map is so good, I'm willing to stay up and do it. I just love it so much. It's a very challenging map too, so I, I like that a lot too. A lot of hard enemies on it, and lots of really good vantage spots. Like, it's not unfair in any way. Uh, it just re really creates a challenge not seen in many other maps. Alright, that's everyone in this maze. Now, we'll just kind of peekaboo shoot all these gunners, so they don't... Oh, crap. So they don't uh, maul us later. Okay, sweet. We go to the right here and take care of this lost soul. There aren't too many lost souls on this one, and I really like that because in the map previous this one there were tons of lost souls, and I hate lost souls. Okay, this is a secret to the left of this tree on the left. You go in this area for a bunch of plasma auto rifle ammo, and then. The easiest way I found to take care of this guy is to just shoot him through this little hole. You can also take care of some of the other enemies by doing this as well. He takes an abnormal amount of shots because of the barriers he's behind. Now there's a couple specters down below us. Um, oh shoot, that was not supposed to happen. Um, yeah, usually I like to have my plasma auto rifle out for this part. Okay, sweet. Don't worry too much about your health, guys, because we're going to pick up a Mega Sphere and get 100 health anyways. So we'll be okay. For now. Anyways, now we can take care of all these enemies. Okay, sweet. And yeah, circle around this thing once you have the, um, your, um, the suit, whatever, that protects you from all this lava. Take care of these enemies now if you want. Um, okay, sweet. So we're going to come to this little secret area later. For now, we're going to go to the first secret of the map, which is right here. Well, actually, this is the second secret, because we got that plasma auto rifle ammo from earlier. Now, this invisibility is going to come in handy in a sec. We'll grab this health here. Yeah, there's, like, no armor on me anymore. And don't expect to see any armor on me anytime soon, because this map has, like, no armor at all. To the left of this torch is a, is a little doorway. And a really tight hallway area with imps. This invisibility is really useful for this part. Being able to kill these enemies across. Now you can use the rocket launcher if you want. But I'm just going to use the shotgun because we have plenty of shotgun ammo on the map. And I want to save my rockets for cacodemons down the road. Now this is a secret area right here. Um, we're just going to pull out. So there's going to be three cacodemons behind this door. And I like to just... Obliterate him. Honestly, you can do the shotgun or the chain gun, but I didn't want to mess with that. Now, we got the rocket ammo here. Now, pull out the BFG, because when you open this, there's a Baron of Hell. Well, it looks like that demon absorbed a large portion of the damage that normally I inflict on the Baron of Hell. Just go ahead and mow these guys down. There we go. And go ahead and pull out your chain gun if you'd like. Take care of the few enemies over here on the left here. Okay. We're doing really good at not taking damage. There is a Baron of Hell, but we're going to take care of him in a second. For now, though, I, I am waiting. So there's a Spectre here. But I'm also waiting for this Cacodemon to get up here so we can just take care of him. I'm moving back and forth so that Baron doesn't hurt me. Okay. Now, guys, what we'll do is run and grab this radiation suit. Just go ahead and take care of this guy. Sweet. And then we'll ride up this lift. I'm actually going to pull out the plasma auto rifle just in case there are any enemies. Just run straight forward and grab this stuff. Now... How this teleporter thing works is whichever side you're standing on, it'll teleport you to that same side. So since I'm standing on this side, it'll teleport me to this side right here. 
We'll now pull out the rocket launcher after flipping this switch. It'll lower these down to where we can kill the Baron of Hell rather easily. All right, sweet. Then we can grab all this ammo and the yellow key. We'll now drop down to this again and go on this side. I'm gonna keep the rocket launcher out for this part. And just shoot, shoot some rockets down this hallway. There were some enemies that were alerted to us um, to our left. That's why I'm moving back and forth kind of right now. All right, run along here. Ooh, look at all those enemies. Okay, sweet. Yeah, there will be like three cacodemons that uh, get alerted to you. That's okay though, because we did save a lot of rockets for this exact reason. And this map does give you some rocket ammo, so that's really nice. Pull out the chain gun now. Um, there's sometimes an imp, yeah, an imp over there. You want to kill him so he doesn't wreck your day later. Punk. Okay, sweet. Here we go. Run and grab the radiation suit. That dumb shock on her. Go ahead and uh, take care of this guy. Don't go in the teleporter, you little... You little... That little bastard. Okay. Literally, I had asked him not to do one thing. Okay. This will flip and lower those little pillars there. So we're going to go back up in this teleporter. And now we can jump across here. Which will bring us to this area that we couldn't access before. Now there's going to be a Baron of Hell in here. Oh, he hasn't been alerted to us. Let's just plot the rocket launcher and take care of him then. There we go. Cat <laughs> punk. Okay, sweet. Um... Normally there's a cacodemon around the corner there, but I think he got alerted to us when we shot those rockets down this hallway. So I guess we don't have to worry about him now. Grab the red key. That'll actually open up the door to to the cyber demon, guys. Right there. Run up on these stairs. Oh my gosh. Not good, not good, not good, not good. Okay. No worries, no worries. Just ride the slip back up here. I'm trying to avoid the rockets that he'll be shooting at me soon. Oh wow, he killed that cyber demon for us. Oh, it's so sketchy. He can see you everywhere in this area, so if you guys make the mistake that I made just now, it's okay. This map's not completely unforgiving. You can run across that, but be quick. Now when you go back down here, grab this radiation suit on the far left. Sweet, we only got hurt once. I usually get hurt twice on that. Go ahead and take care of these guys. All right, guys, this is the part of the map where I died probably the most, and that's because you have to be so quick, and the timing has to be impeccable. So we're going to get all that stuff right there now that this is opened up here. Um, let's grab these bullets before we go. Okay, so grab these items. Now what you want to do is you want to rush down here, lower these lifts, hide behind this thing for a little bit, right up. Now run straight... Oh my gosh, that was the hard part. I'm so glad that's over. I'm gonna pull up my rockets because we need to be quick at this part too. Oh shit, okay. okay. Normally I try not to swear, but I'm in a pretty tough spot right now. 11%, that was not smart. Pull out your plasma auto rifle. But now this is the part you wanna be careful at. Grab this. Ride this down. Now he's gonna shoot you a couple times with the rocket, but it's okay because we're invincible. There we go. And now, run up around here so he doesn't shoot you back down. And just get up in his face and spray into him. There we go. That's that, guys. Against the wickedly. Holy cow, we had a sketchy ending there. I've never been that low in the health. Okay, yeah, so the only mistake that I made that I would reconsider... Well, there were two mistakes. First off, when I tried to run across the stairs, when we grabbed that red key and the cyber demon was there... I fell down, but it's okay because I showed you guys an easy way to fix that. The other mistake I made was <laughs> using rockets when you should have been using a plasma auto rifle or a BFG or literally any other weapon but the rocket launcher because that part is just insane. Like, I got completely obliterated by my own rockets. But yeah, guys, one of my favorite maps. I love the theme. Same theme from episode 4, map 2. Or no, no, episode 2, map 4. There we go. It's a shame they don't use that theme more often in other maps, but I'm really glad they use it in this one. 
Especially because you get to kill a cyber demon, and that's pretty awesome. Super badass. Um, but yeah, guys, uh, being one of my favorite maps, we're now going to move on to the seventh map and Hell Followed. I'll see you guys in the next one.